everyone. Welcome to our channel, Rebecca Stu and the Crew. I'm Rebecca, and today we have a new Dollar Tree video for y'all to see what's new and popular restocked items at the Dollar Tree for the week of November the 11th, 2022. So let's go shopping. The first part of the store we'll go to will be apparels and accessories, which you can find in different locations around the store this week. The only thing new I really found were these extra large scarves by the Juncture brand. They had solid colors and patterns. They also had these new hats over by a lot of the t-shirt bins that they usually have. And these were the layer 8 UPF um, 40 plus hats. It says that they are boys size hats. And if you look on the back, they all have the tags on them still. It says it's a $20 hat for just $1.25. So that's a great purchase. Also, they had these crescent moon jewelry um, necklaces back in. You can get them in the... Um, silver or gold coating or plating and uh, they have a couple different designs with the moons and stars on them. I found a few of the Lord's Prayer necklaces in earring sets in gold and in silver. They had these out last year around Easter for a few weeks and then I was able to find them just this week at two different stores that I went to so they are starting to put those back out again. There's also these eyeglass cords which were new. They're the extra thin ones but they have some new designs and just the style of them kind of caught my eye. They're on the end cap near the eyeglass tools to fix your glasses with. And there's a few different ones of those out also. Then over in the arts and crafts this week, I was so excited to find these wood palette signs. It looks like a slice of wood. It's got the um, bark kind of like at the top and the bottom of the uh, rectangle. They do have these in three different styles. I only found the rectangle, but they have an oval and a circle as well, which I saw online. Then they have the large wood circles restocked, and I found a few more stores that were carrying the DIY dream catchers, and there are six different ones in all, which I showed you guys on Tuesday. If you didn't catch that video, I just wanted to make sure you guys were aware that these are a new product that is out in the arts and crafts section. They restocked their DIY DIY wood dice. You get three dice. They're like a one and a half inch cube. So that's really good. You get three in a pack. I found a whole bunch of the DIY lanterns and then a bunch of packs of the gemstone style stickers. And it's a bunch of different designs. I carry these a few times throughout the year. Usually once they're gone, they're gone. It takes a while for them to come back in and they do sell out quite quickly. You get basic colors you get two shades of pink there's a lighter pink a dark pink there is the silver black blue and gold and occasionally they also get red though i didn't see any red stickers this time in the sets of stickers they seem to gear it more towards a lot more of the dark shade of pink instead of the red stickers which it would be really nice if they would have put the red ones back out since we're so close to christmas and christmas crafting is so popular right now then there were these gemstones stickers you get a hundred pieces those are the ones that have that ombre look which again i also showed those on tuesday in case you missed it then i found the uh, solid sheets of the rhinestones uh, gemstone style stickers you've got the the blue pack the pink the black with the silver and then they have the multicolor and gold there were the small one-piece gemstone stickers for the sports. If you got the volleyball, uh, basketball, the megaphone for cheerleading, and then they also had the rhinestone baseball sticker. Now for the baby items, there's not always a whole lot new there, but they did have these really cute um, new feeders, which I've never seen at Dollar Tree before. This is the Angel of Mine brand. They've got these fruit feeders. They're a little bit different than the mesh bags, which I've seen at like larger retail stores. Um, they come in pink or blue. It's got a cap over the... Um, little nipple there with the holes in it so you remove the cap but um there's just like this little tab you flip up and you can put fruit down inside of it then close it up and it's got uh these large holes in it so the baby can teeth on a nice cold piece of fruit and have a little snack at the same time safely then they had these flip cups with a straw it's got the handles on both sides which are really nice you can also get those in pink and blue i don't know if they're spell proof or not over in the health and beauty this week we'll start with the cosmetics there wasn't a lot new in the cosmetic section they did have some novelty style cupcake lip balm this is 
is the blueberry flavor. They also had strawberry. And then I thought that purple one was great, but it actually says it is donut flavor. So there were three of those. Then they had this lip balm in peppermint. It's a nourishing vitamin E lip balm. And it's the green for the peppermint, or you can get the, it's kind of like a pale yellow, but that is the sugar cookie scent. Now for the hair care, just a few new hair items. They had a lot of these, like the smaller size scrunchies. So you, they're kind of thin, so you get five in a pack. They had a couple different um, cards with five each, different color schemes on each one. Some of them are printed. There were some more of the scrunchie brand um, scrunchies. Those have like the tie on the end. It's got like the little tassels. So it looks like a bow. They had a few different like animal print and floral print patterns. And you just get one for $1.25 out of uh, the scrunchie brand. They had the corduroy uh, covering in it's like a rose pink, a cranberry kind of red color, and then this bluish gray color that they had out. Then on the green cards, they had these silky, satiny style um, scrunchies, and it's got a really pretty border of like a black lace around the edge, which was really pretty. On the pink cards, they had um, headbands with the kind of velvet velour style material. You can get the red headband. There's a matching barrette that goes with it. And um, they had like these alligator clips on the back for the barrette. You could also get the um, black headband with the matching barrette. They had, so I believe it was the like dark red. They had the black, the light pink kind of rose color. And then they did have a dark navy blue. Though I only saw that in the barrette. I did not see any of those in the headband. Also, I found this um, Be Pure Anti-Frizz and Curl Defining Cream. The hair serum for anti-frizz has it smooths dry damaged hair. And then you've got the curl cream to help uh, make the curls a little bit more defined. Over in the pharmacy and personal care item, I found a few more of these Crayola 3D Puzzle bath bombs at I believe it was two more stores this week so that's I think four out of the six that I usually go to that are carrying those right now they have the two-step cleansing mask and then there are these new shower fizzer tablets by the be pure brand this one here is the coconut scent and I think you get three in a pack they also had the lavender there was also the aromatherapy shower fizzers and the eucalyptus and spearmint. Fun finds, just a warning, if you're sensitive to flashing light, they are going to be flashing in just a second. So please be mindful of that and just skip ahead. I found these $1.25 disco lights. They take three AAA batteries. They're so cute. They light up a whole entire room. It was so fun. I bought these for my little girls for a nightlight. I thought it was a lot of fun. I actually had fun playing with it myself. So just so you guys know, those are out. And now for the home decor. So I found these large windows. They look like a faux window. They're metal. They have a hanger at the top and they had them in white, gold, and and black the gold one has some like um, black brushed on undertones to make them look kind of rusty or worn also the white one has some gold undertones and then the black one is just a solid matte black there's no rust look to it it's just the solid black they're about a foot tall they're quite large also they had out their glass candle holders which i just love when they put these out they've got this really pretty pale greenish blue color and then you've got the two-tone with the green and white or the solid white the pale pink solid black solid white or you can get the white with navy blue now the white and navy blue one that you're going to see here in just a second this is the only style in it that i saw i'm sure there were probably more but that was the only one that was left in that color scheme but they just put those out and now we'll move over into office, home library, and teaching tree section. They have these journaling markers, which they've been putting out periodically. So you've got the paintbrush tip. They have black, pink, and blue. And then they just put out these new metallic colors in silver and green is what I've seen so far. So I'm just going to show a quick video here of what the green and the metallic silver look like. Um, at first, it doesn't really look very metallic until it dries. And then if I move the paper around when the light hits it, you'll be able to see that metallic look to them. Um, I really like the tip of the marker. It gives you a really pretty um, color and a nice wide stripe there when you write on the paper. There were these Crayola poster stickers also they put out some more packs of these they've been getting more and more in these in as i've been noticing the last few weeks you get 56 letters on the um letter sheets 
and they've got a couple different new styles like the pink with the white and black polka dots, the balloon kind of look letters, and then they've got the white with the black trim or the black with a darker black trim. Over in Housewares, Home Maintenance, Storage, and Electronics, they have these new USB Type-C adapters in a few different colors. So I found them with like black, red, gray, and blue. And um, you just put those on the end of your adapter to change the end there. There were some of these LED candles. They had the off-white and red pillar candles. The red ones they usually only carry around the holidays. If you want them in red, I wouldn't hesitate to buy them when you see them. There were also the pillar candles. They're starting to put those out in Christmas colors and their essential storage bins with the buffalo plaid. Now for the kitchen and pantry items. At a few more stores this week, I was able to find these glass candy jars. They're quite large. Large. Um, they only sell them a couple times a year so usually around the holidays is when I'll see them and then they had these canning lids um, in gold so they've had them in silver all summer this is the first time I've seen them in gold and you get 10 in a pack also in the create a gift um, last minute gift idea kind of homemade boxes they've got the margarita mix which is non-alcoholic and some of their um, bakeware for the holidays they also had these one pound pack of salted roasted peanuts and the charms fluffy stuff snowball cotton candy now we'll move over into the party supplies there wasn't a whole lot new over there but they did have these new cake toppers which i just love i found these over by the bridal section they have mr and mrs and bride to be they were only in gold i don't know if they sell them in other colors sometimes they also have sil silver just gold was there right now and then the happy anniversary uh they had it in two different colors of pink dark pink and a light pink also they've restocked a whole bunch of their ribbon usually they carry like blue purple pink yellow and then around the holidays they'll add a really pretty white white, silver, gold, and red. Also, there were these wands with a foam um, topper, and it's got these little tassels that hang down. They're rainbow. They have um, the four pack of hearts. You could also get the four pack of stars, and then they had the four pack of unicorns. And those were all over in the birthday party supplies. And now for the pet supplies, I believe I showed these on Tuesday last year. We would personalize these in a video just to show some last minute gifts for pet lovers. Or you can personalize these little scarves here with some vinyl. Over in Toys, Games, and Entertainment, they had a whole bunch of these puzzles and games out this week. Gearing up for gifts for children and Operation Shoebox where they um, package up gifts for kids and uh, ship them. Uh, through a service project. They've got a whole bunch of these puzzles, which would be great. There's two puzzles inside each box and they kind of go hand in hand with each other. Like you've got the two puzzles with the emojis, you've got the fairies with the fairyland, and then different things like sweet treats and the bumblebees and things like that. Also, they had a bunch of the color form games. It's like a sticker, but it's got the original like board game, but you just use stickers instead of plastic pieces. So last year they had Battleship, Sorry, Monopoly, um, Guess who? Candyland, Shoots and Ladders, and I believe Trouble. This year they have a few new ones. They have Hi Ho Cheerio, they have Junior Monopoly, and then they also have Junior Scrabble. So it was nice to see they put out some new games this year. Now for the seasonal items this year. Um, we've showed a lot already, but they're still putting some items out. They have these large round signs that have a really cute farmhouse feel to them. They've got the red, green, and black and white buffalo plaid. Each have a different saying in the middle. And then they've got the uh, buffalo plaid signs here that say things like home for the holidays. Christmas wishes and hot cocoa kisses and Merry Christmas. They also have the large gift tag size, um, signs with Santa and some Christmas scenes in the background and the gnome signs that look like a large um, Christmas ornament. It's got the faux metal at the top of the ornament. There are two of those and they've got their farmhouse signs that say like reindeer farm and fresh farm Christmas trees. Those are just amazing. I love them. I think they're so pretty. I also found these monogram floor mats for the holidays. I love this one here. It looks like an old Christmas sweater. I love the coloring. And then you've got the monogram mats with the um, snowflake in the center. So these are the only letters that I was able to find. I took a picture of every one. So we would have a picture of each one. They never carry the whole alphabet, which I don't 
know why. I mean, I kind of know why, but, you know, obviously they can't carry every single letter, but these are just the ones that I was able to find. I also found these farmhouse style coffee mugs, which I just love with the little red truck in the farm in the background. So cute. I know those will not last long. These large charger plates that say happy holidays. Those are the melamine, but they also have the glass plates that say cookie for Santa or just the solid glass plates. Um, that they have out right now. Also, they had their ornament tags in the gold glitter. And again, these are all the letters that they're carrying right now. At least those are the ones that were left when I was there. I try to take a picture of each one so you guys know what letters are available. And they do come with the hook to attach them to a stocking. Then they had these glass figurine um, Christmas trees in white and then this like kind of muted sage green color. They're actually really pretty. There's a couple different designs and they're about six inches tall. I was so excited to find these window lights. They take three AAA batteries. There's a suction cup or a hook so you can hang them from the window. And the on and off button is at the top. Also, they had these monogram yard signs. It looked like Santa's suit. And they've got a Santa hat at the top. And they are covered in red glitter. Really, really cute. I've only seen these at one store so far. So I'm sure they're just starting to make their way to stores uh, this week. So keep your eye out for those. And again, I took pictures of every letter that was left. I don't know what all letters they carry, but you might be able to find that out on the website. There were also these flower sack towels. Um, they had the Express Your Elf with the Elf shoes. And then here's a close-up of that. You can see the hat. Also, they had um, Up to Snow Good with the snowman. And then it's covered in these gray snowman hats. They had one covered in blue snowflakes. It says, um, it's time to get your jingle on. And then I'll be gnome for Christmas with the gnome hats. And those are all those flower sack towels there were the stocking holders they had a whole bunch out this year they've got the penguin santa snowman angels um, quite a few different ones that you can choose from and i love that they're adding different skin tones so you can choose what fits for your family they also had these claymation style ornaments that you can personalize on the little name tag there. They had uh, Mr. and Mrs. Claus. They're so cute. They also have the elves. There's two different elves that they have. I'm a sucker for these ornaments. They're my absolute favorite. They also had the gnomes and then an angel. So cute. I just love all the detail. They brought back the gnome booties, which are the... Um, Christmas ornaments. They had these out last year. And then these really cute door hangers that have a farmhouse feel to them. They have four bells attached. And then um, the door hanger at the top is covered in twine. And you've got a little bit of greenery and some pine cones. These are absolutely adorable. They had their small little pillows that you can hang. They have a hook on them. There are three different ones. Those also have a farmhouse kind of country feel and some new glass dishes. Do these say happy holidays with the white background and the red decoration on the front with all the different floral patterns for Christmas like berries and pine needles and some pine cones. They had the large dinner plate, the salad plate, a bowl, coffee cups. They also had the pot holders. You get two in a pack for $1.25. The oven mitts, you just get one. And then they also had some kitchen towels. You also just get one for the dollar 25 price point then they had a whole end cap of these uh galvanized metal signs i love the believe one they also have this one that says comfort and joy they're about a six inch round circle these signs on a stand they have noel also one that says peace they had jolly hope and as you can see, they're all on those little wooden stands. You can paint those if you like, if you don't really like the way they look. Also, they had these vertical signs that say Noel. They had Hope. And then Joy. Those were about 10 inches tall. They were quite large. Also, the hanging signs, they've got a large Christmas tree. You can also get the stocking. They have one that looks like a Christmas bulb. A snowman. And then some of them have more detail to them. They've got the large gingerbread men this year. They also have the Santa. And a gnome. And then they had the camper with the Christmas tree on top. Also a little car here with the Christmas tree on top. 
the stand with the red truck and it's got the tree in the back. I guess it's not a red truck. It's supposed to look like a red truck. And then they had these picks. You get two, you either get the Christmas trees with the stars. They had snowmen or two snowflakes. And now we'll move over into the Dollar Tree Plus items, which are the $3 to $5 items. I showed these faux mercury glass Christmas trees last week. I didn't see the green one, so I wanted to make sure you guys knew that was also available for $5. For $3, they have these belt ornaments. They are really pretty. They're 5 inches, so they're quite large. Also, the $5 tree toppers in either silver or gold. And then they have the $3 4-foot tinsel candy canes, which is a pretty good buy because they're $5 at Walmart. Also, they had some Christmas pajamas for your pets. Love this one with the snowman on it. It's so cute. They've got the little legs and everything. They're really funny. They also have the buffalo plaid and the red and black. And then my personal favorite is the pet reindeer costume. They come in small, medium, and large for $5. These are actually really well made. I think they're a little too warm even for Texas in the winter. It's just a little hot for dogs, I think. But super cute. I love the stuffed antlers on the hood. It just makes me laugh. Also, they had these shelf sitting characters. They have the snowman and the Santa and the buffalo plaid black and white or the red. And then they have the um, angels, Santa um, and Mrs. Claus there. Also these snowbirds. So cute. They're three dollars each. They had a couple different ones wearing like hats, scarves. Um, some of them are wearing a sweater. And then they also had the metal Christmas trees in the gold and silver. Those are, I believe, 18 inches tall. And that's it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share if you haven't done so already. And here are some other videos from our channel you might also enjoy. Have a great weekend, everyone.